Today I tell you the tale of Dave the Walrus. Dave the Walrus lived in a little place known as the North Pole. Dave loved his mother very, very much. Very much. He had a best friend called Stuart. Stuart happened to be a seal. Hi Dave! <laughs> Hey. And they both enjoyed watching Boston Red Sox. Oh yeah! Boston Even though there were many thousands of miles away from Boston. Anyway, we move on. Dave and Stuart went everywhere and spent most of the day together. And did everything together. Until tragedy struck. <laughs> Stuart moved away. Oh my gosh, Stuart, please don't go! Dave was all alone. <laughs> Most of his time, lazing around, doing absolutely nothing, except eating fish, of course, which I some more. Anyway, one day, sitting on a nice iceberg, Dave thought to himself, Well, what? What if I go someplace? See some things? So he heads off. He heads, and he swims, and he swims, and he swims. <laughs> Jumping on various cargo ships, <laughs> and... Monitoring on various and floating on various icebergs until he lands on a coast. A distant coast. A, a concrete jungle in Canada. Canada! Canada. 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 Anyway, Vancouver, Canada. You know the whole story. Come on, come on. Geography people, geography. Okay, so. He orders into Vancouver, thinking, oh my gosh. He ends up almost getting captured by the pen. <laughs> but eventually, he gets himself a job. Mysteriously and weirdly, humans employ walrus. Anyway, don't worry about it. He becomes a member of the airport security team at Vancouver International Airport. Oh my god! Ah, uh, I know that one! Oh. Anyway, anyway. I know this. Basically, basically, Dave spent most of his time, 9 to 5, 9 to 5, scanning people, <laughs> and doing various things, <laughs> mostly <laughs> confiscating fish products. Give me anyway, that fish. One day, in his lunch break, he walks outside, <laughs> has a waddle around, <laughs> and discovers the fish. And ships <gasps> Oh my gosh, he says. Oh my gosh, fish and ships. Oh my god. Anyway, he waddles up a boat to order the best slice of bad Cadigan chips. Until he noticed the man behind the counter. But it isn't a man, remember, it isn't a man. It happens to be his notorious friend, Stuart the Seal. Stuart! Okay, so you make Stuart, and they all happen. So once again are reunited. Yay. And Dave and Stuart go on. Go on together and travel the distant town or city should I say, known as Vancouver. Dun, 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 dun. Thank you for listening and tune in for more Dave the Warren. On King M. Dun, 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 dun.